Have you been there before? The scrapyard? Nah. Just seen the sign on my way to camp. So would he be allowed to drive still, so he has one hand? What if we just, like, walk to the main road? This isn't the main road? No, this is all Hackett property. The main road is another mile that way. Wait, how do I know so much more about everything than you do? Wait, shut up. So basically, it's another hour walk to the main road, and then at least another three to four hour walk until we hit the nearest... whatever? Yeah. What was that? Let's just keep moving. Okay. So, I guess this is me now. What? You're gonna look great with a hook. We can call you Hooky McHookface. Okay, that's a fair point. He could just put a hook on it and latch it with the uh. Yeah, I guess it's pretty unique. I could get different attachments for it. <laughs> yeah, man. Lean into it. One hell of a story, too. Yeah, I guess it's something to talk about on the radio station. We're all gonna be laughing about this in a few years. You, me, no, you maybe even Ryan. <clears throat> Kinda got close at the fire pit back there. Am I crazy or was something about to happen? It was always next year, right? Well, let's get through this year first. Wouldn't really matter anyway. It looks like we finally know Ryan's type. Confident. And heroic. With an eye patch. So pirates. <laughs> Maybe she shivers his timbers. <laughs> there. I just no fucking three hour walk, but you know, for obvious reasons, makes sense. Oh shit. Relax, it's motion sensor. We're okay. I think. Oh look, steampunk's back in. Ew, come on, this way. Hey, I don't care what you say, steampunk shit is cool. Okay, now where have we go? we do now? Well, I guess we just make ourselves at home. Live up some cocktails, see what's on the TV. <laughs> you know? Why are you always so positive? Oh, why do you keep asking me that? Uh, I because asked you about it is confidence, impressive. It's not your Whatever is happening right now. Ugh, I don't know. I guess I just don't like to see other people sad. Is that why you do the internet video thingy? Internet video thingy? Whatever it is. He vlogs. You know, people think influencers do it just <clears throat> for the attention, and maybe you do at first, but after a while, it's like. What's the difference between 4,000 rando likes and 100,000 rando likes? But I make people laugh. I act dumb and they laugh. Maybe that makes me dumb? Or maybe I just like to make people laugh. She likes making people laugh. That's what it is for most YouTubers. Including me. Well, fuck this nine, huh? Yeah. Come on. I want to hear you say it. Fuck this night. Fuck it all the way to morning. <laughs> See, I feel like that's the voice actor of Velma from like Scooby-Doo and Scooby-Doo 2, the movies. Put me down! Easy, ma. Put me down, you old witch! Blow your fucking head up! Ah, bitch! Everybody just relax. Can't shoot what you can't see, darling. Now oh, shit.
gotcha. No QT? No pain for what you did to my Kaylee. Get the fuck ah, bitch, up! You're gonna okay. You're gonna okay, bitch. Oh, damn! God damn, she is. No, no, she should not have came close to me, bitch. Everybody stop! Constance. What the fuck is going on up here? Uh, uh wake up. Wake How the up. fuck she gonna wake up from that, man? Darling. I blew her fucking face off. She's gone. Little Bobby. Mom's gone. Cool. Yeah. No more party. No more protecting anyone. Travis. Now it's all old bars. Pretty good. Fuck. Oh, well, I guess it allows him to go. Oh, oh, oh. I know it's a garbage chute or something or a laundry chute. I'm not sure what that is. Uh, okay. All right, that's I'm not even sure how to pronounce that, but much. MCC, I don't know. Here in America and California. Pull that shit out. It'll be fine. Didn't hit any major artery. Maybe a lung. Okay, he'll, he'll be fine. Fuck. And now he has some type of defense. Oh, okay. Yeah, American. <clears throat> okay, tell me he still has the knife. Do he still have the knife? Fucking idiot, Ryan. You grabbed a fucking knife. Where? This is why I don't watch horror movies because they piss me off more than they scare me. Ugh. Ugh. Cause like I swear, who is gonna leave the knife behind? Like that, that right there is probably a silver knife too at that. With these people being around it for so long, they're... Oh, that is... Gonna definitely need to be something I use. But with these people being around this as long as they are, they would know silver is what kills them. Why did I open it? I uh, want to play that game. It's downloaded on the PlayStation 4, but I won't be playing it for a while because currently one of my family members have it. But I do want to play through it, and it, it's kind of like this. But it's not in terms of like a horror movie game, so I don't know how I'm going to... Or a horror game, depending on what you want to call it. Well, I am enjoying this one for the most part, but honestly... It's just a classic horror movie trope that they use that piss me the fuck off. I know Detroit Become Human isn't it. It's a thing about androids. And how they kind of slowly become sentient. Oh. 
the voice of Mr. Krabs is actually one of the main characters in there. There's really nothing else here. Oh, it's locked. Great. <clears throat> oh, shit. Oh, hi. How are you, buddy? You little big boy. Depending on how you look at it, though, the game could be considered horror. So you don't want AI to become sentient. And you know, that's how you get the, the Terminator type shit. Do that, you fucking idiot. Don't close it, just leave it there. Just don't don't close. Okay, cool. I'm close. Stand by. Over. Instant ban. They don't need to be in here. Run. Oh, I crap. I might have fucked up. Oh, no, maybe not. ideas. She don't touch it. Cool, they gave me the option. <laughs> other uh the games that have replaced the uh, telltale series i can't think of their name right now but one of them is like a plague tale or man of madan M man of madan in which that's actually a true story one and they're actually so well put together the man of madan one is uh involving hh H. holmes which is Killed a lot of people in the, uh, the hotel that he supposedly owned. Okay, then we tree so we can see how far it goes down. Uh, I'll have 
to look it up in a second when I hit a cutscene. So that I can kind of... I can do it real fast. Oh, okay, yeah, it's the uh, Dark Pictures Anthology. That's what it is. Uh, Dark Pictures Anthology, though, that right there has phenomenal storytelling. Like, I've seen it, bits and pieces of it, and I want to play through the entire thing myself. Playing games no more, little girl. Try me, motherfucker. You know something? Well, I ain't got enough silver to kill you, but I sure to hell can make you suffer. Gonna kill him as I go. Because they are legit attempting to kill me, so running is a bad idea. Also, she's a badass. God damn. Jacob is dead. He is so dead. You think Jacob's gonna die here? No. You no, 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 wait, wait, ow! Goes one of the characters. Hey! I mean, to be fair to Travis, they are actively trying to kill her. He was kind of annoying me. Like, right now, yeah, I get it. He's trying to help. But... Or not the... Not that, but like at the beginning, he was trying to help. But he gives off that... Like, he was the one who's behind all vibes. Just like the way he was acting and everything, he kind of gave off the, uh, you know, it was me vibes. <clears throat> and 
Plus, he's also like a slightly dirty cop in a sense, but he refuses to actually harm civilians, I guess. He is listening to the walls, you can tell. takes on in your walls to a whole new level. Ah, oh, see, he grabbed the fucking knife again. I told you, Ryan's an idiot. Oh, come on, man. This is you... my knife. No, please. Please. Nobody takes my knife. You stabbed me! You're leaking red like a juice box. No, oh, please, you, you can, you can help me. No, man, you're bleeding out. The only thing I can do is put you out of your misery. Humane life. Uh, 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 <sighs> oh, Laura! Oh no, you've been bit! Pick on someone your own size. Travis! <laughs> 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 oh shit. Oh, oh, easy. Easy. What the fuck happened to you? Oh, you know, nothing out of the ordinary. Oh, Ryan. Bubba kind of oh. gives off, um. How bad is it? Patrick vibes. He feels like Patrick the Star. I'm so sorry. <sighs> That bad, huh? I keep trying to fix it. Whatever this is, people keep getting hurt. First Max, how you? He's gonna be like, yeah. No, fuck man. It. I didn't want to say it, but... You shouldn't have come with me. You think? Am I dying? You've lost a lot of blood. But it'll, it'll heal though, right? It'll heal if you can stop the bleeding. Wait. Maybe it, maybe it will. What? Ryan. If you let me bite you... What? If you let me bite you, it means you'll be infected. Which means... Which means it will heal. Yeah. But it also means... Yeah. Yeah, I got it, Big Bad Wolf. Yeah. Ryan, I don't have much time. I can feel it like it's fighting to get out. If you let me bite you and you heal, then... Then I have to kill Chris. It's, it's not killing Chris, it's killing a werewolf. It's saving your own life. And mine. And Max's and your it? friends, too. Alright, I think I'll accept it. Let you bite me. And live to kill Chris Hackett. Or bleed out and die. Pretty much, yeah. It's your call, for now. So we doing this or no? Do it. Because I'm correct, as long as I kill Chris, <laughs> Everybody else should cease to be the, the werewolf. Uh, or not Chris, but like the head head. 
Nice and tender for you. He should start to feel better soon, I guess. That's what his fortune is. It where, uh. Why well, I like to get blood back? Because once I lose that blood, I don't have it anymore. Or no blood. I'm not exactly sure how blood works. <laughs> it's been so long since I've been in school, I don't remember. I had to quickly fix something. Okay, now we're at the scrapyard. Guys never throw anything out, huh? No, scrap So, do you want to give me some direction on what we're looking for specifically? Well, most of these cars look like they've already been stripped with parts, just empty frames and chassis, which doesn't help us much. Okay, so we're looking for engines? Well, anything relatively intact. Got it. So, obviously, no. Looks like we got our work cut out for us, huh? Try not to make too much noise. Oh, right. Oh, boy. Anything by you? Not yet. Keep looking. Proceeds to say he's trying not to make too much noise. Proceeds to make noise. Oh yeah, as you can see, I cut uh, Dylan's hand off. Exactly, am I looking for here, game? These sons of bitches had it all planned out. Who's T? Mm. I'm assuming that's the Looks sure. like these guys were cooking the books a little. Dodgy. You said it. Oh. What did that say? SUV body damage. Okay, good, good. Laura's car right actually. As Laura and Max, they came in a Jeep. Unless that's what they're talking about. They're like the fucking SUV as a or a Jeep as an SUV. That's gonna be weird. 
So now I'm going to look for an SUV. Um, Max is the, you remember what, during the flashbacks of, uh, yeah, it, it's with the flashbacks. That is, Laura's boyfriend, or fiance, whatever you want to call it. And you just look at the map and be like, oh yeah, Jacob's in. Which we already knew that. Yeah, currently he is one of the, uh, quote-unquote werewolves, which they look to be a mix of a werewolf and a vampire, honestly. Judgment, huh? No, uh, more of scared to do anything. And very weak. So he goes and says, and I quote, don't hit me, I bruise easily. Like, why are you gonna say that? I guess you get chopped out of the stupid, actually. Oh, is this a working car? I mean, it's a working car. It looks decently put together, but it's not. Okay, I can't fit through that. I'm too fat. Crushes the cars are fucking huge. What's this? Aram Scarum. Oh. Seen this, Caitlin? She's the one who's been helping us. Okay, pickup truck. Yeah, well, see you, man. Thank you for chilling here. Okay, okay cool, and another cutscene. Nah, I knew it. Fucking this. That's the same fucking car I drove in. So, you ever operated a crane before? I actually used to be pretty, pretty good at the claw game at my local arcade. The kids used to call me the grabber. No, no, uh-uh. Uh oh, that I hear that, no. Look, why don't you see if you can lower it down so I can take a look under the hood? I don't know what he's gonna sure. do with the gun. He has sure one thing. fucking hand. Um, just uh, watch my back, yeah? Yeah. All right. 
looks like somebody's mom never taught them how to clean up after themselves. Okay. Oh shit, how am I gonna do this? Alright, not too complicated. Staying clear because I'm not sure how this is going to work out. You did it! Yeah, uh, I think I found my calling. About time! <laughs> oh, maybe we can see if we can. Try and get this thing running. The amount of schooling that you would have to go through, and he just does that casually. Not a good idea. Dylan, thank you. You actually saved my life. For realsies. Yeah, you know, no sweat. <laughs> For realsies. I just can't wait to see who they choose. What? To play me in the movie about how brave I am. Don't push it. <laughs> okay. <sighs> so, so much for our brilliant escape plan. Okay, back to the lodge. Well, it seems like we killed one of them. Better than being out in the open. Come on. So, you know, there's a bright side there. It looks like we at least killed one of them.
We can't just sit here. Why not? Dylan said it's safe here. Uh, yeah, I just... I don't want to be waiting around. But that's literally all we need to do. Just wait until morning, right? Fine. But we need protection. Go see what you can find. It's better than just sitting around. Why don't you help me too, damn it? Okay. I have found so many tarot cards. Assuming you're not supposed to get. Yeah. Hope it holds. Okay. Okay, I really can't see in here. Oh. Oh. Huh. Looks like the main fuse is gone. That's why there's no power? Why would somebody do that? What is it? Silver shells. How'd they get down here? The hunter must have dropped them. This is probably how he got upstairs and attacked Caitlin. These fucking guys are everywhere. Okay, so she put that in her pocket. I guess, you know, we have a lot of extra now. What'd you find? Oh, I'm uh, just checking out this ladder. Is that a tiny little door up there? Uh, yeah. We'll open it up. Why? We don't know what's up there. Exactly. Have you not been paying attention, like, at all? Okay, what I mean is, it might be good for us to have an escape route. You know, we don't know what's up there. It, it, the lodge. She there, has a fair point. There also could be a, a, a way for us to defend ourselves. She, she does have a fair okay. point. Guess that makes sense. You can climb a lot faster than that. You all right? Oh, well, yeah. Okay, yeah. that was that was close. To rest a bit. You'll feel better soon. Cool. I'm feeling pretty good, actually. What are you doing? Stop it. Do you smell that? No. Never mind. Let's just find another way down. A way to Chris Hackett. Or just a way out. Maybe I'm done being chased and stabbed. Sure. And another way out. Fine. Okay. 
Watch your step. <clears throat> yep. Oh shit. What was that? I think. I think we found Chris Hackett. Son of a bitch. He is. That is tall. And he just broke it. He just broke that shit. Boxing it, and he got knocked the fuck out. Now everyone's back to normal. What? Oh. You think this is over? This isn't over. Uh, ah, shit. I don't understand. Chris is dead. That's probably not Chris. Oh. Oh, Chris wasn't the first. Oh, okay. That's not possible. Caleb. Kaylee. The girl you killed? Her brother. What? <sighs> Caleb bit Chris and Kaylee. Chris was just trying to protect him. He was a good man, my brother. Well, then who bit Caleb? Silas. I've been tracking him for years. He's a, a gypsy, a transient. He'd been long gone from the area, but we hoped he'd come back so we could end this. Anyway, there's sightings up and down the coast. A feral albino child, giant white wolf. A wolf. What? What'd you say? Where? Where'd you see it? Hey, buddy, at, go. The at the cabins earlier tonight. Okay. Okay. Okay, it makes sense. It all makes sense. Yeah. He must have been back for months, and he's what ran you off the road two months ago. Help me. Help me. We can still save Caleb. We can still save what's left of my family. We... we can help those who are still alive. Yeah. 
Why the hell should I trust you? I'm not asking you to trust me. I'm telling you we can end this. We kill Silas, everyone gets better. Everyone, uh, who's still alive anyway. Okay, okay. So, where would we even find him? I know exactly where to find him. Okay, let's go. Okay. This doesn't mean I forgive you for what you did to me. I understand. Can someone please get me some fucking clothes? So I killed three of the Hackett's so far. You had right back where I was. It's you like a, had oh, cool. Your chance. You had your chance to wipe out that wretched family, and you failed. Doesn't matter. There's still time. We can still come out on top. Past is the past. Let's just <clears throat> look to the future, shall we? Death. Death takes many forms. It could mean change, transition, transformation, often interpreted as a, a beacon for the hopeful. In your case, it means, well, it just means death. I like how she's blunt about it. <laughs> it, it, it just means death for you then. <laughs> oh, she might be dying. The sun, the vitality of a new day. There's still time to wake up to the warmth of a night survived. Your choices, your actions, your very life hangs in the balance. It's up to you to find your path in the darkness and see the sun rise once again. Judgment. The bells of judgment cry bloody murder. Or do they? The fury of a hatred earned. A fate deserved. Likely. But he may have his uses, though he won't forgive. He won't forget. The Hierophant. Where did you find this? Oh. Where did you find it? This shouldn't be here. He's been through enough pain. No, no, no. My poor boy. You see what that did to us? No. Oh, shit. What have they done? What have they done? Oh! Yeah, she really just had like a vendetta against them. She's the reason for all of this, in a sense. Silas, my boy! Oh! Ah! Oh! 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 Oh!
What the fuck? Mommy's coming, Silas. Mommy's coming, Silas! 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 He's gonna hate me at the end. No, no, no. My poor boy. You see what they did to us? How they hurt us. Yeah, you're gonna hate me because I'm gonna kill him. All alone. Each full moon they hunt him. Armed with silver. Trying to put an end to a curse they inflicted upon themselves when they set my show ablaze six years ago. Stupid, stupid. Little Silas. My little white wolf. He must be protected. He must not follow this path. Do you understand? Remember how I've helped you all this time? Remember how much I've done for you? You haven't done all that much. 